In the next few minutes, I'll show you five legal software websites that deliver clean, safe, and truly free tools without the bloatware, ad traps, or fake download buttons you get from sites like CNET or Softonic. Let's be honest, most so-called free software portals aren't designed for you. They're designed for ad revenue. Take CNET, for example. It's got a long history of bundling junk like McAfee or browser toolbars, unless you manually opt out during install. Softonic? Filled with fake green buttons that send you to affiliate pages instead of the real download. Even File Hippo, while better, often hosts outdated versions that haven't been touched in years. The result? Slower PCs, background junk running for no reason, and even security risks, all from trying to install something simple. But there's a better way. I've spent weeks testing and verifying sources used by developers, IT pros, and privacy-conscious users. These five sites are 100% legal, completely free, and built around transparency, not profit. Number one, Ninite.com. Ninite lets you select dozens of popular apps like Chrome, Firefox, VLC, 7-Zip, Steam, or Notepad++. It then generates one installer that silently installs the official versions with no extra software, no prompts, and no telemetry. It's widely used by system administrators for bulk setups because it's reliable, fast, and respectful of your system. Every installer is digitally signed, and it pulls directly from official sources. If you set up new PCs often or just hate clicking through installers, this one's essential. Number two, awesome free software. This isn't a regular website. It's a community maintained GitHub repository. It curates high quality open source alternatives to commercial software organized by category, graphics, audio, security, development, and more. Every entry links directly to the official project or repository along with its license, mostly MIT, GPL, or Apache, meaning they're free to use, modify, and share. You'll find amazing tools like Krita for digital painting, KeyPass XC for password management, and Shotcut for video editing. All mature, active, and genuinely capable. The list is constantly updated by contributors who test and verify each pick. Number three, FileEagle.com. FileEagle is a minimalist directory that focuses on freeware and portable utilities. Unlike most portals, it clearly shows file size, version number, release date, and developer name for every listing. No pop-ups, no redirects, no sponsored traps. It even archives older or discontinued tools that still work great on modern systems. Every file is verified manually or linked directly to the developer's page. It's not flashy, but it's honest, and that's rare. Number four, softwareinformer.com. Software Informer doesn't just list apps, it tracks them. When you install its optional client, optional being the keyword, it checks your installed programs against a massive database of over 700,000 apps. If a newer or safer version is available, it notifies you with a direct link from the official publisher, no shady installers. The site also gives you change logs, user reviews, and whether the program is portable or admin only. It's perfect for keeping older or niche software up to date without endless searching. Number five, free lunch, available at github.com slash octors slash free lunch. This one's another GitHub gem, a hand curated list of free legal alternatives to expensive commercial tools. And it's not just free as in beer. Every entry is open source or freemium with a genuinely usable free tier. You'll find replacements for Adobe Photoshop like PhotoP and GIMP, for Microsoft Office, LibreOffice, and only Office. Even Figma and JetBrains IDEs have solid open source stand-ins like PenPot or VS Code with plugins. Each entry includes system requirements, short rationale, and direct links. No fluff, no middlemen. The maintainers care about privacy, offline use, and long-term reliability, not hype. So there you have it. Five trustworthy, legal, and bloat-free sources for software that actually respects your time and your machine. 
None of these require accounts. None push ads. None bundle junk. They exist because people still care about good tools, not just clicks. Bookmark them, use them, and share them with someone still downloading from CNET. If you value clean, honest tech content, hit subscribe. I don't chase trends. I dig for tools that last. Stay efficient, stay secure, and never settle for bloat again.